All right, welcome back to Bryce out here on 10 Tampa Bay. It is 522. Let's talk tropics now looking out over the Atlantic. There is a lot to talk about this morning. One obvious thing is Hurricane Sam, which remains a major hurricane this morning. We've got two other invests 90 and 91 L as well as this third disturbance, which has a 50% chance of developing. This is actually the leftovers from tropical storm Peter. Let's take you down. Let's talk about Sam first strengthening overnight. The eye becoming better organized. The thunderstorms around that eye wall are certainly more robust this morning. So that combined with the hurricane hunters taking a flight into the storm late last night overnight. Wind speeds are up to 130 miles per hour, so it is a category category four hurricane once again forecast basically the same as yesterday. We were expecting these minor variations in intensity expected to remain a major hurricane through the rest of the week into the weekend. It'll be very close to Bermuda into Friday night and Saturday morning likely still as a category three hurricane, but from there as it moves over cooler waters, it will begin to weaken as it tracks up to the north and east. These other two systems don't look like they're going to intensify much, maybe becoming a tropical storm. In fact, 90 L is forecast to become a, a hurricane potentially. You see though these systems will start to turn to the north and stay over the open waters of the Atlantic. Regardless though, if they do become named systems, they will use up the last two names of our lists this year with Victor and Wanda. After that, we have to go to our extra names, which is the supplemental list for 2021. Guys.